Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So it's season 43, and this is war number 10. Only two more wars after this one. And we're going up against an alliance called Dark Guardians. All right, let's see, who did they ban? All right, so they've banned uh, Ant-Man Future, Warlock, and Ghost. All right, let's check and see what their defense looks like here. Nope, won't be messing with that. Zemo. All right, tough uh, fight on this first node. Oh, this guy here. I always forget that he auto blocks. Very annoying. Otherwise, it's a pretty straightforward fight. Let's see, we got Domino. Okay. I mean, I could take him with Gallon. That is a possibility. Let's see what we got here. Okay. So that's going to be, of course, Magneto. Uh, and they put this guy here. Um, so Claire. All right. I may just do the same, um, same team. Look like Claire. Magneto and Hulkling. Because I think Hulkling will be able to take that one. And his auto block won't help if I do it when I'm unblockable. So I think that's what I'll do. Same team. Let's see, is there anybody over here? No, probably not. <laughs> okay. Yeah, so we'll go in with the... Uh, our, our what's becoming our regular team of um, Claire, Hulkling, and Magneto. All right. I'm probably going to pump some uh, six stones into Magneto because it looks like I'm going to be using him often. <laughs> All right. Let's get on with the fighting. All right. So I'm going in with Hulkling, Claire, and Omega Sentinel. You don't often see Omega Sentinel uh, on my team but I got a reason for her, all right? So I take path three in sections one and two. And uh, as you can see, we have a very, very difficult fight on that first node. And now we get to fight Captain America Infinity War. Now, let me tell you something. I have issues with this guy. I, I don't know why. When I fight him on pretty much any node, something always happens to trip me up. I just I don't I don't know. I'm gonna have to spend some time and practice this guy. I really do. All right, so you can see here I boosted up and everything. Not really expecting uh, too much of a difficult fight here. All right, so you can see here, Hulkling is great, you know, and all I want to do is get uh, to my special two and fire it off while I'm unblockable. However, as you can see, I'm unblockable, but I'm special locked. I always forget that Hulkling is not immune to the special lock. So right here, my plan, this fight should have been over, but I was special locked. So I couldn't fire that off. So I fired off the special three. And I'm like, okay. And then that happens. One mistake. And he's at a special two. Boom. Done. One mistake. So what happened? First of all, my plan went to shambles. But I was like recovering from it, right? Then when I came out of the special three, I saw that he was stunned. So I went to attack. The stun ran out. I should not have tried to punish that at all but the stun wore out i went in caught a nice you know couple of five pieces and that was it and i was so upset because it should have been over with it should have been over with i mean this was an easy fight for hulkling but instead i get wrecked 
<sighs> I tell you, always something. Always something. What I should have done is just play the safe. Let him come out of the stun. And then just kept going. Now, one of the reasons I really need to practice is that special two. Because had I been able to evade that special two, I wouldn't have been uh, in that situation. Because even hitting into my block, I think it would have taken me out. Which is why I tried to evade it. And I don't know how to evade it. All right. Anyway, that's uh, one death out of the way. And this time I put an invulnerability boost because I was not trying to um, get another death. Okay? Wasn't trying to get another death. All right. So this fight should be pretty straightforward and easy, just like the last fight. But as you can see here, nothing. Domino got nothing for this girl right here. Nothing. Look at this. All them uh, heals that she got don't matter when you got a heal block on you and omega sentinel has such an easy access to a heal block look at this oh that evade they had to do something anything because she getting her butt whooped right now mm. that's right domino yeah i got a love hate relationship with domino yeah finish her mm. that's right Yes, sir. Uh, if you guys have followed me, you know my love-hate relationship about Domino. She's constantly, constantly taking me out. And I wouldn't even, because I didn't have really good counters for her. So she was always taking me out. Ooh, that annoyed me so much. Because I would, I would, get, I would get taken out and I wouldn't even get a chance to get hit. Nothing. And she would just take me out. All right. Next up, you saw we bypassed that middle. No more that uh, um, <clears throat> uh, Baron Zemo. So now we've got this Nimrod. And while he's easier on this node than the other node, you still have a little bit of an annoyance, you know, because of his uh, armor ups. But Claire can handle it. Um... She can't handle him on the other node. That is one of the uh, issues with him on that node. Now, if I could make Claire uh, shock immune, then she could take that node as well. But for the time being, it's all good. Oh, yes. Just stay in uh, blood. And uh, this right here could take me out. That's why I have to be really careful pushing him to a special two. I can evade it, but one mistake, one miss, and he'll get me. See that? Look at that. I got clipped by it, but look at my health. So I'm not worried about his special one. You wanna, you know, just basically bait out that special one. It doesn't do a lot of damage, even when I get clipped. See, look at that. I got hit a little bit more. Okay. Did it out. I got back some of what I uh, lost. And Nimrod is down. A much, much simpler and easier fight uh, when he's on that node. Definitely. All right. Now, this fight here, also pretty simple and easy. Uh, he does not get armor up so any good counter for uh, Nimrod is fine. Okay. Um, I don't know if he would be more difficult awakened on here. But this is me looking through to make sure he doesn't get an armor up. But I decided to go in with uh, Hulkling anyway, just in case I missed something. Um, and, of course, Hulkling needed some redemption. That's all. But, yeah, on, on this node, that uh, Cap America Sam Wilson would have probably been better, even though he did get a, a kill, mainly because of my mistake. But he would do better on this node than uh, that one. 
But Mysterio is annoying if you don't know how to fight him. You know, having to wait out after he does his special one. Okay, so you see here. Now you look at that. What he did right there, I hate that. And that's not Mysterio. That's anytime you have anyone that benefits from them blocking. You hit into their block or anything like that, suddenly they don't want to block no more. You see them blocking, you go at them, they drop their block and, and dash at you. What, what, what was that? Anyway, that is the last fight that I had to do for this particular war. And we'll be back in a minute and you'll find out how this war ended. And we're back and oh, so close, but we lost this war. Look at the score, y'all. Look at the score. So close. You know, Dark Guardians, great job. Great job. We could have had this one. We really could have. We were close, but we just could not clench it in the end. Uh, but anyway, that is going to do it, guys. Thank you all for watching. Feel free to hit that like button if you enjoyed it. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video. And you all have a blessed day. Thank you.